Hi, welcome to Drill Tip Tuesday. Whenever I run out of ideas about what to draw, which doesn't happen that often, I do have a few um, go-tos. For example, I love drawing food, so I like drawing at the end of the day what I ate that day, for example. But what if I want to draw at the beginning of the day and I just had breakfast and not much else? What about drawing what you're wearing? So today, that's what I'll be doing. I am drawing today's outfit. Okay, let's start with the sweater with green stripes, but I won't be drawing the stripes. I will use my paint later to uh, add stripes. I'm also wearing jeans, so draw those. Just a few details to show that they are jeans. I think the stitching is always a great indicator for jeans. And I think, um, again, um, when I add a little bit of color, it will actually uh, become more clear that it's jeans. And I can also write it right next to it. I'm wearing um, very comfy sneakers today. So I'm trying to make sense of how to draw those. Also, I'm carrying my backpack with me with my sketchbook in there, of course. And um, in case things are um, not clear enough, I can just write some stuff next to it. And uh, maybe some additional info, like those jeans are getting a little bit tight. Yikes. Taking out my watercolors, and there we go. Green stripes and um, blue jeans. And I'll add a little bit of shading to those white sneakers. And my backpack is black, so I'll mix Van Dyke brown and indigo for a nice dark gray. Because I don't have black in my color palette and this works just as well. The stripes have two different shades of green, so I'll add those. And I'll add a little bit of shading to the jeans as well. Speaking of shading, I think I want to add a drop shadow. And of course, things bleed into each other because the colors hadn't dried completely, but I kind of like the effect. Okay, so that was one approach, just drawing each item bit by bit. But of course, you can also draw yourself wearing the clothes that you are wearing. Maybe you can create a little character of yourself. Now, I have created a little bit of a strange character of myself, but I kind of like it. And those jeans are tighter than they look in this drawing. But still, um, I think it's a really fun posture and I look really happy in this outfit. Again, adding a little bit of color makes all the difference. When you draw yourself, you can also add the color of your hair and um, your skin and all that, which makes it perhaps a little bit more personal. Plus, it is a great way to practice drawing people. And now to finish things off, I will add a little bit of extra lettering just because it's fun, giving this drawing a title. And then I also like adding a little bit of color to the title, which is matching the color of my drawing. And just a little bit of shading to give the lettering a little bit of an extra oomph. Well, that's two approaches to draw your outfit and maybe you can even come up with a different approach. So um, I can't wait to see your outfit and the way you have drawn it. If you care to share, do that on social media using the hashtag DTT in action. And I'll see you next week. Bye.